<laughs> well, hello and welcome, everybody. We're going to be doing a stream today. The idea is that we're going to play a game with uh, one special rule. I think the rule should be that we must, at some point in the game, sacrifice a rook. Oh, seriously? <laughs> there is. Gotta find well, a way to sacrifice. Well, okay. Well, hello there. Welcome to Shadow Chess episode three. I think today we are with my friend Sean McCoy. Uh, what's your Twitch handle, uh, Sean? I need to add that to the template oh well, gaming villagers gaming villagers on twitch yeah. and yeah okay so it seems we're up for a special kind of games today i want to say i i want to enforce the five fight uh, time controls for you <laughs> so it's because if you're going to only one game do you want to do a longer one maybe like 10 2 or something like that a longer... Oh, okay. That makes sense. Ten two. Yeah. Okay, let's do, let's do custom here. Ten two. I'm going to send you a challenge here. Uh, oh, okay. I was doing the same. Just for our souls. All right. So, game on. Okay. okay. And you must sacrifice a rook somewhere oh. in the game. But you must sacrifice it too, right? Oh yeah, yeah. We we both have to do the same thing. That's why it's equal. Okay. Oh so man, my primo. Oh man. Attack, <laughs> can can I sacrifice a bishop <laughs> instead? <laughs> we we may need to restart here. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> Did you lose well, connection? Let's, let's do another game. Restart this one. Okay. Okay, let's accept. Okay, let's rematch. Yeah, rematch. Okay. Are you there? Seems my internet connection went All right, down. I'm white now. Oh, man. I want it to be white. Can you hear me at all? Yeah, you're there. Did you... Still communicated through chess moves here. Okay. Can you hear me? Yes. Mm, okay. Oh, okay. <clears throat> okay. So today is a special episode because we are not doing... I, I was planning... What I usually do is I do some lessons first like tactics trainer or drills or whatever and then I jump into live and play some games so today we're just gonna have fun you got it all right you know this is a very easy position for me to start the rope <laughs> Yeah, I know. Uh, well, you I'm know that, right? I'm gonna switch. I'm, I'm not gonna play the Yugoslav attack because uh, it's just <laughs> it is so easy to sacrifice a rook. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, that's it. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> Stay away from my. But, you, but see, with the with the queen in this D two, my my rook sacrifice wasn't worth it, really. Well, yeah, but the fact that you have to commit one really changes the value of the rook sacrifice, right? Because I'm going to have to make a rook sacrifice at some point too, yeah? So you want me to sacrifice for a pawn? <laughs> Is that what you're saying? Yeah, I don't mind that. <laughs> getting the whole night out of it, that would have been bad. I see, I see what you see. I see what you say. So uh, what if I take your queen with my rook? That's, that's a kind of as a sacrifice? <laughs> That's not a sacrifice. <laughs> that's, that's, a, that's an American politi political sacrifice. Right. Yeah. Oh, look at me. I'm struggling. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm not seeing the sacrifice here, fellows. <laughs> That's good. That's good. What I am seeing is is the D5 pound push. You totally forgot about that, I think. 
Yeah, that's true. I was so excited about um, <laughs> stuffing your rook. The, sac <laughs> the sacrifice. Oh, this is a terrible position for me. Um, mm. <laughs> Oof, it's so bad. It's, so bad. <clears throat> it's like I'm going to do the other rogue sacrifice. <laughs> the one that we've talked about. <laughs> okay, kicking away my knight. Uh, but my knight has some probably good places other good places to go like here for example and then back up yeah I, I like waiting moves because I can take advantage of the d5 for example and we're playing so fast <laughs> That's true. Uh, I forgot, that I forgot it was a 10 2 <laughs> yeah. game. Completely forgot about that. Okay, let's let's think for a second. I'm glad that you, you thought. <clears throat> Yeah, I'm not really thinking about a rogue sacrifice <laughs> right now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's that's something. That's something. Hmm. Oh, does that win you a piece? No, no, it does not. No, because you, ha you also have a, a hanging bishop, yeah. Interesting. So if he takes, right, we're doing that. I take, and then he can take here, and I can also take here. But where's the rook sacrifice, man? <laughs> I'm trying. I'm looking for I can, it. I can. I can sacrifice then the ex the exchange like right next to it <laughs> in the next move. But this is probably our most interesting game since we started playing yeah, no, live for for the crown. This game is not. It's uh... ahoy! The sacrifice, indeed. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you moved your bishop. Right, so that means I get I sacrifice the exchange for nothing because that was your worst bishop <laughs> by far. All right, we're gonna play it dangerously. Meaning that are you gonna play? Are you gonna check me? Okay. I like that move. <clears throat> I'm just going to ignore your attack, which it's usually what I do. And that's why I lose my chess games. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Nice. That's not really a sacrifice, man. <laughs> oh, no, that, that was not a sacrifice. That's not a sacrifice. <laughs> You, okay, that is a sacrifice. <laughs> <laughs> All right, nice. Yeah, I, I wasn't gonna try and jinx you on that one. Uh, but you know what? You know what? I think your sacrifice cost you a bit too much. <laughs> no, no, I didn't. Or, or at least you give me the knight back. We're fine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, are you sure about that? Oh yeah. No. 
I'm silly. No, I'm really, I'm, I'm silly. I, so I thought I had the, the checkmate here, but you can just. Oh no, that would have been terrible. I wouldn't do that. Block. So if your if your king was in h1, that this was a checkmate. Yeah. How about this then? Well, that's just, <laughs> just annoying. <laughs> okay. How can I make this work? I'm hoping you don't, because it would be... <laughs> <laughs> it would be really bad for, for your rating. <laughs> yeah, oh, you're 1510. Um, Is this still considered Blitz, the, what, you, what we're playing? No, I think it's... Well, I mean, I, I, I challenged you on rated. I don't know what you chose. Oh, okay. Oh, that went my other rook sacrifice. What did I do? Oh, man. <clears throat> that was terrible. I don't know it's as bad as you think it is. Why? Um, well, because, you know, I was really th intending to threaten d8 mate. But that's not really happening, actually. I don't see why not. Because your bishop's uh, guarding d8. Thank you very much. <laughs> that means I can take your your other bishop. Yeah. I got your back. I got you. <laughs> Thanks, man. But this, I'm. I went from a far better position to a not very good one. That is true. I mean, the bishop pair has to be something, but my king's exposed and. I think I and got now I, now. yeah, I can't defend. I mean, I get this. Well, I can exchange and then move the other bishop. Yeah, yeah, that does work. Yeah, you got a much better end game. Oh man. Oh, so you're a full piece now. Yeah. Which is annoying. So I think there's no way for me to win this one. Yeah, I think uh, even though your bishop covers the square, I think. Um... It's lost. <clears throat> you can still blunder though, because, you know. But you end up with an extra rook, and that's... That's oh. like gratuitous rook sack. <laughs> Perfect. <clears throat> now I wish we, we we had played I don't know three two. Why do you? Uh, why would you rather three two right now? Oh, so you could try to run out the time or? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So you'll be low on time by now. Okay. We I can see how you can win this game. <laughs> <laughs> let's let's end the suffering right now. Let's do one more, that was fun. Yeah. Start over. Like yeah, you you kicked my ass in fifteen minutes. <laughs> Well, what do you? No, I, uh, what I enjoyed was the the having the sacrifice of rook. Let's do. Uh, what, do you want to do queen sacks this time or a peace sack? Queen sacks. Mm. We can do queen sack, yeah. So we can, What happens if I checkmate you and I didn't do the queen sack? Ready. 
getting connection issues, but I think you said that we're doing queen sex. Yeah, yeah. I said, yeah, we are. Right. I was just asking, what happens if I checkmate you and didn't do my queen sack? Oh, well, then I, I have a moral victory. <laughs> <laughs> right, I see how this works. Oh, you know this variation? Oh, yeah, this is... Uh, I, I play you it do. pretty regularly. Crap. <laughs> <laughs> Man. All right, so So queen sack. That's a useful sack right there because <clears throat> I'm protecting. And actually, I should have played rook, rook to e1 to further protect my pawn because <clears throat> I didn't see that you have two well, pieces. The issue I have with the line I'm looking at now is that, that we trade queens and don't sack them. Uh, we trade queens where? In, in c2? Yeah, I, this is a, that is an unforeseen wrinkle. <laughs> what I'm seeing right now is that I suck my queen on h7. <laughs> okay, I will, uh, I will allow it. Uh, yeah, that's probably not the best suck. But, <clears throat> yeah, that was terrible. Why would I suck my queen on, this, on h7? That's stupid. I can suck other things there. Yeah. What if I, uh, am I allowed to take your queen? No, because then neither of us can win. Right. <laughs> that's 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 really odd. <clears throat> it's a little frustrating, yeah. <laughs> how how am I Oh you're two up, okay. So I can just, just place my queen right here and you cannot take it. <laughs> Um, oh no no no! Uh, I I can take it, right? You because, have to sack it. Well, that's that's sacking your queen. So oh, that would be a sack. Oh okay. Yeah. You, yeah. So let me uh, let me first sack mine. <laughs> okay. Yeah. <clears throat> that was terrible. <laughs> and then I sack mine. Yeah, I kind of I almost feel guilty taking it now. Well, you like, you, you make you make the rules, you know. <laughs> yeah yeah. That, it's a lot easier to win games than to make it So you're up a rook now. Right. It's hard to think. That is uh, the terror of the human condition. Oh, certainly. Oh, man. I just lost, lost my rook there. Nice. <laughs> You gotta check well, out this uh, Gary Kasparov masterclass, man. It is, it, it's got tactics up the wazoo. Are they good? Oh, they're great. I mean, um, so tactics is where I suffer the most in uh, tournament games. Yeah. And um, there, there's this weird thing that happens to you when you get better at tactics, which is that initially it's it's bad for you. 
because you see more options, but you haven't learned when not to choose the extra stuff. So that right. got me in trouble. In one year. But other than <clears> that, <throat> like my, uh, my, you know, I'm, my issue is that I had been playing people and been beating them pretty well with these positional games. But I had Oh, crap. Um, <laughs> <been doing it. laughs> I just hang a piece. Metal, so <laughs> uh, but I have been blowing people off the board. But mm -hmm. uh, in my last few uh, few outings, I've been able to blow people off the board, which is nice. Because mm. it's it's frustrating to have to take every game to a positional ending. You know, uh, it takes a long a lot of time. In the big tournaments, yeah. you just don't have the energy to do it. I see. <laughs> well, I'm just gonna resign here. What's what's gonna be our next rules? <laughs> Same thing, queen uh, suck. Let's do. Uh, we did king sack. <laughs> king sack. Don't think we can keep as, but we can do a peace sack. Okay, yeah, like any peace sack. That would be yeah. like more normal. That would make it much more normal. Yeah, it yeah. would be like chess. Right. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm gonna play Rui Lop the Rui Lopez, which I never do, like never ever in my life. <clears throat> well, what do you th do? You know anything about Roy the guy? No, I I know that he was a Spanish player, uh, really really old, right? Like the fifteen hundreds yeah. or something. Yeah, and he um, there's a lot of cool stuff to know about him. Like actually, hmm. Well, you you can enlighten us. What the hell, man? You think you're gonna get away with that? <laughs> <laughs> yes, I do think I'm gonna get away. With that. <laughs> oh, so that's your sack, right there. <laughs> That's a good one because leaves my king <coughs> in the open, <coughs> prevents me from castling. <coughs> that was a really good sack, actually. That works. Yeah, quite amazing. Act. Oh, I should have oh, just taken. Man. What was I thinking? That bishop wasn't protected. It would have been like that was checkmate. Oh, okay. I missed mate was... in one. Oh wow, you missed. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> no, okay, now you have to work it. <laughs> <laughs> this is so silly. Like, <laughs> well, it's a and thing I... where you see a line that's so good, you just stop calculating, right? Oh, I'm I'm just doing the <laughs> most stupid moves. <laughs> In the history of mine. <laughs> Why am I doing this? Maybe because I'm tired because I play Minecraft for three hours. That, that, that'll do it there. Um, oh, man. And then also it's just weird to play a game where you're like trying to sack a piece, you know? Yeah. And you're already and you plus nine. Have, you only have like two pieces left to sack, honestly. <laughs> Here it comes. Wait a sec. <laughs> but wait, wait, wait a second. I mean, that counts. I I suck like three pieces already. I I can <laughs> take you to the positions. <laughs> technically true. Yeah. <laughs> technically, technically, I did it on purpose. I mean, how can you tell? And I, I, I look at this. Another sack. Yep. There you go. <laughs> there you go. Perfect. Now I'm gonna checkmate you with my king and pawn. I'm gonna oh, show you. Uh, I have a story uh, while we're still playing here to tell you. Um, <laughs> there was a a scholastic tournament in South Carolina before people had a whole lot of um, knowledge about what was, you know, while South Carolina chess was still in its infancy. I, I mean, it's still in its infancy. But um, this uh, kid um, goes up on his opponent to where the guy's just got his king – and Kid B is armed with a, a rook, 
a queen, a bishop, and a knight. Right? Hmm. So one kid is just winning the pants off of everything. Yeah. And but the other kid doesn't know how to mate. Oh. So he starts moving pieces around and he gives up first his rook <laughs> and then his knight. And the kid who's still down like a bishop and a queen and only has his king looks up to the other kid and goes, Now I'm coming for your queen. <laughs> <laughs> right. I'm I'm coming for you man, I'm coming for your pieces. Like for example you put your knight on, on D five right now. Right now. D five. Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah. Now well you already you already moved it away. Yeah, sorry about that. Here, coming for your rook now. <laughs> <laughs> oh come on. Stay stay where you are. Stay quiet, man. <laughs> <laughs> you gonna throw? <laughs> 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 annoying just, king the annoying oh no. king oh, was my knight trapped <laughs> no it's not it, it's... I was like it was supposed to be a joke Matthias. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god this is like the anti shadow chess episode where we unlearn everything that <laughs> everything we achieved. unlearn everything that we learned in the past two episodes right here and we have a, a lot of time we could end up with more time in the clock oh yeah we've got eight minutes and 11 seconds to find a nifty mate here <clears throat> you're, you're I was close what I, missed. I was like i thought i had mate there yeah i, I had just one one second. That's annoying. Come on, mate already. I'm trying, I'm doing my best over here. <laughs> <laughs> so if your knight went on, on D5, you had you will have a beautiful mate. Right there. Yeah. Oh, I have pounds. That would be a stalemate. Yeah, yeah. Okay. You I, I almost through the game <laughs> so you want all right one more last one i guess we can do another one like any sack would any could sack. do yeah. any sack I'm and then the then i have yeah. to go no except pounds i mean peace peace sacks oh any peace sack you got it. That, yeah, that does sack. seem to be the cooler way to play because that like actually helps your chest you know right because pound suck, I mean, we, we pound suck all the time <laughs> at this rating. Uh, we pound suck. <laughs> all right. Let's get some space advantage over here um, I've never actually executed this particular attack before so it's causing me some issues here the which attack um, I'm about mm -hmm. to break in the center and pawn storm with the king side but I've never oh. I, I, I was just made aware of that being available in these sort of uh, Slavic positions um, yes I've seen that day. in some games He's yeah quite amazing so i've never i've never executed it before so this is going to be i'm pretty sure i'm not doing it right already well you're not doing it wrong either but maybe i can break first like right now because you, you actually block your your pound defenses with the knight Mm. You just ruined the sacrifice I was planning to do. <clears throat> oh well. <laughs> <You> just... <laughs> oh, my bad. 
<clears throat> okay. I think it's now now it's time to think. <clears throat> so I have the isolated uh, D band which is absolutely atrocious. I don't know how to deal with it ever. Sack it. Yeah, but how? <clears throat> if you push it, you get a lot of tempo for that one little. Oh, but you lose the the rook in the corner. Never mind. Ah, uh, thanks for that. Up your black square bishop. So. <clears throat> yeah, I I do need a black square bishop. I mean, that's going to be a long term advantage for you. So. So these knights, knights need to be repositioned, but your actually your pawn structure is better than mine. Yeah, yeah. Because my pieces are un uncoordinated. Okay, maybe I can do this. There's your sacrifice. Yeah, it's the best one I could come up with. That's a cool sacrifice. This uh, is great training. We should do this like for real. Yeah. Because this is that is not a tactical series I would have noticed had I not only been looking for sacrifices. And if you take with the queen, I attack with the rook, and then I get the uh, rook in the corner. So it's, I think it's just... Mm. Yeah, actually really, really good. So now you're attacking my knight with two pieces, and I think I can just defend, because I was, I was thinking of sacking my knight, attacking your queen. Mm. But that's not nearly as good as, your, as yours. Your sacrifice, and also you can just get my rook for free. I mean, not for free, but so I'm just gonna defend here. I'm gonna think of another sacrifice. Does that count as a sacrifice? <laughs> 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 that's the part of the rules we we just came up with this today <laughs> yeah we didn't we need to iron this out okay this is a sacrifice because <coughs> my my white bishop is not really doing much Oh yeah, man! It's still a sacrifice, even if your opponent doesn't accept it. That's got to be a thing. Uh, okay, which well, I think you need to fulfill it. Now it's a hell of a sacrifice. It's like I'm sacrificing my butt. <laughs> 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 and we came up okay. I mean, it could have been much worse. Yeah, yeah. No, I, I feel like I I must have missed an opportunity in there. To be honest, I was lucky. Okay, so what? What the, the thing is now? You have a power majority in the king side, which is great. I think yeah, I think this is the best move here. So that was a hell of a sacrifice there, like a multi pieces sacrifice. By no means I calculated that, so don't be scared. <laughs> So we are, how are we going to do this? What are you threatening? Yeah. I am threatening <clears throat> some things. Uh, oh, right. That's not good. 
That's not good at all. How do you... Okay. That's cool. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so if I get my king here, queen is a checkmate. Oh yeah, definitely don't go back to G. Uh, G yeah, I need to go to the middle of the board. All right, I'm back. And you are about to rip me off. Doing my best here. Um, okay. Yeah, I was careless as usual so I mean probably if I had more time to analyze the position I would have uh, realized that it was a uh, probably a worse position and now I'm losing my knight I, I the evaluation of this is, is beyond me because I, I know we're not playing best moves um. <clears throat> Yeah, but I'm, I'm missing. I'm I, I, like I'm hanging everything. Yeah. Okay. You got me with those checks. Yeah, because with the knight gone now, you can't double attack my bishop while pinning it. So that's yeah gives me a lot of uh, a lot of safety here. It's just too hard to to guard the checks and. And play in a quick game the queen is just very very easy to play yeah all right man it's been this one's been by far the best game of all well that was neat I, we had one in the beginning that was incredibly rich too I think, <laughs> uh... yeah but anyway I'm going to yeah it's time to resign it's time to go for me, actually. Unfortunately, this was yeah. a very short stream. Have but I do, go. I do like this uh, this format. The whole, uh, um, you know, sort of coming up with a rule to yeah. uh, expand. I have to come up. Let Let's resign. I want to share uh, analysis for a second before going. So, but maybe you missed you missed something here because after all the exchange. Oh yeah, you're you're up a piece. You're plus two, but computer is saying that. Okay, look at that. Now you're you're plus one point eight, which means that this pawn move was not the best move. So I'm in twenty three f five by by black. And uh, yeah, okay. you are. Computer says plus two is the same of the evaluation actually. Okay, yeah. So we played through there ever pretty equally. Uh, it's just, just this is so much easier to play for black because the um, the coin is just it's very easy to coordinate it with itself and you've got to get the yeah keeper. my pieces are really uncoordinated uh, I think your pawn majority on the king side is better so yeah that's yeah. that's that's the key to that's this game the plus two is but um, you know I, yeah. I think realistically. For, for humans playing this position, it's like it's more like plus four uh, for black because it's just so hard. The computer can coordinate those pieces no problem, right? But, yeah, but uh, for we human, can't. Just, uh, yeah. Well, after 95, uh, 25, knight b5, it's a plus four, plus five. So that was uh, my mistake there because I probably did not see the pawn advance. Yeah. And that's devastating. Pawn advance is, is devastating. What I was trying to do is mounting the pressure on this on the pawn on a7 here with my two yeah, pieces. Yeah, when your rook comes down, yeah, I, I think. But it's um, not it's not enough. No, I, I think what one thing that uh, uh, it looks like h3 is a move that White has to play. Um, it's got to get the you know it's so easy for me to pin the knight to the rook so. 
Uh, maybe the best way to avoid that is to drop the uh, bishop back to a6 uh, and then be able to retreat it to e2 at some point. Um, oh, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, be yeah, before all this, sorry, before. So, like, for example, here, bishop. Oh, and I can't move? That's That's really weird. Oh, it's... It's something our analysis board is not analyzing very well. No, 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 now it is not because it was, it was, okay. uh, I'm going to reload it and see what happens. Next turn. So, so Bishop here, uh, but you, you're still winning by a lot. Like, I don't know what you can just keep advancing the pawn here. Yeah. Then I can check and you just go and you. I mean, I can try things, but it seems that no matter what, yeah, black is is winning at some point. Yeah, and with and with the two pawn advantage, I think even two engines going at it would uh, yeah, win. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, man, that was fun. I love, I love the <laughs> I love that format. We should do that uh, next time as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, thanks for having me on your stream, and uh, hopefully we can do a chess.com official one here shortly. Okay, awesome. Thank you. Thank you for being here. All right, that's all for today's episode of Shadow Chess. So I hope you like it. If you do, leave a like or subscribe to my channel for some more chess. And I also play and stream Minecraft for now. And maybe I'll continue with some other project that I had there before. I like to play stuff like doom quake champions we'll see we'll see what we do so see you around